Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to tonight's stream. So yeah, uh, my setup for tonight's stream on my schedule was pretty messed up. So I wouldn't worry about what you've seen, according to my schedule. Move Love is still happening, but I'm going to play Atelier Riser instead because I just have more of a feeling to play that right now than I do Tales of Arise, which we will do next week. So do not worry about Tales of Arise. We'll do that Monday. Guaranteed. <coughs> but yeah, we'll focus on today. So uh, we're still walking towards Chizuru's route. We still have um, a bit of a ways to go. But, you know, we'll be fine. And then Atelier Riser afterwards. Anyway, without further ado, let me just uh, get the game volume back up. And uh, off we go. So yeah, last time we were working towards uh, Chizuru's route. Had to stop part way through. Because, you know, it'll take a while. Because there's the new dialogue to read and all that stuff. All that good stuff. Uh, just give me a sec. I uh, didn't take my shoes off as I came in today. There we go. Uh, relief. I hope that's as loud as the game volume was before. So yeah, again, good, good, good morning. Good, no, 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 again, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Yes, let's uh, get to it, shall we? Make sure auto skip is on. Obviously, class rep and Ayamine, but of course, we already did that. We already did all that. Working towards the big game. So yeah, we are going to be walking Sakaki home. I just remembered there's some place I need to stop by. She's gonna try and come with us, isn't she? Yeah, I did think she wanted she wants to go with Takeru. Sakaki, Takeru got to Chumade, Michiga onajita to it. Yep, I, I will. <laughs> She's like, the fuck? Why? Takahashi, kuruma o. Does Maya know? Does Maya know? Kashikomarimashita. Doushite? <laughs> Wrong button. Doko ah. yo. Oh no, no, I skipped it. <laughs> ah. I just need to go somewhere. Doko yo. It's a secret. What about you, class rep? Nice yo. Okay, that's fair enough. <laughs> then let's get going. You're going down the hill, I presume. Well, yeah, fair enough. It is on top of the hill. That's true. Oh, there is a very good reason. <laughs> I need to go somewhere. I could ask you the same question. <laughs> they are more alike than I'm sure class rep would like. <sighs> Only two days left, huh? So ne. We're gonna win, ne? <sighs> Come on, you've gotta have confidence. Ne? Everyone's depending on you, class rep. Have some confidence. Well, you're the team captain, so you kind of are. Then who? Oh yeah, look at me, of course. The manager. The self-proclaimed manager, mind you. Nani, is there something on my face? <laughs> Oof. Nani? Wazatorashi. Hey. Nani? You know, class rep, it feels like you've softened up a little. Although your behavior is still exactly the same. 
何それ意味不明。<笑> exactly the same, but you changed. <laughs> like, that's a. Yeah, what do they call that? It's a. I can't think of it right now. You used to seem really uptight. Demo. Not so much. Not quite so much lately, I guess. <gasps> I never thought I'd see you laugh at something like that. You got that one, eh? You got that one, eh? You got that Alright, looks like, yeah, looks like we are lucky. Ugh, no kidding. Baka. Go men? Nan de monaiwa. Come on. Shirogane kun no yewa at chide show? He did say he needs to go somewhere. <laughs> It is. Jane. Didn't I tell you I needed to go somewhere? It's a secret. Now let's go. <laughs> well, we're in, the,、uh, we're in the shopping district, so I guess pretty close, right? I'm not following you on purpose. And besides, class rep, where are you going? <laughs> hmm. でも、白金くんはこのコンビニに用があってきたのよね。おお、し、グッド。おし、おし。あれそうよね。<sighs> そうでしょ。Which place? うん。じゃあ、ここでさよなら。<laughs> Take care on your way home. 白金くんも、わざわざありがとう。I wonder why she's thanking me. Can't say I've ever felt so mystified by class rep before. Won't happen again, I'm sure. Guess I'll go home too.、Uh, maybe she knows he just wanted to walk her home. And this was just an excuse to get him to go as far as he could. Alright, might as well pick up some pudding for Mayor and Zumika while I'm here. Good idea! Okay. Not quite the day of the tournament. Shirogane kun? Auto skip turned off. Call for class rep. Class rep! Nani? I heard that you did it again. Nani o? With Ayamine. Ah.、Oh. Well. Yeah, they are always gonna butt heads. That's just inevitability. Their personalities too much co conflict with each other. Since this happens all the time, I won't bother asking what it was about. But you're not gonna let this get in the way. Ne? Nani ga? The sports festival's tomorrow. So ne? Yaru dake no koto wa yaru wa yo. You're still not upset about what happened yesterday, are you? それで損するのは誰 ?I think it'd be everyone's problem, wouldn't it? <laughs> Everyone on the team, anyway. Yours, I suppose. わかっててくれてるならいいわ。でも、あまり蒸し返されると、忘れられるものも忘れられなくなる。Fair point. うん。My bad. ん <laughs> ごめん、八つ当たりだったもう行っていい、uh, sure. Go ahead. それじゃあ、hmm. At least class rep appears calm for the time being But she might be feeling different inside Underneath the surface Ah,、uh, that's the dog again The little bow wow <laughs> Alright, now this is one thing I'm not sure what to do. I think come up with a backup plan is what gets us the common ending, if I remember correctly. Best uh, double check, let's make sure. I mean, you know, this is probably one of the only choices that、uh, makes it potentially go bad.
do nothing. I believe. Yes, do nothing. Because we're gonna get Makoto as a backup just in case. Right, so this is the match where it all goes really bad at the end. Yes. Just in case you just in case you first time following me, basically during the match they ended up getting into a bit of a disagreement. You know, they weren't playing as a team, Sakaki and Ayamine. And then they all went for a ball with the uh, the enemy team's captain. And uh, she came off a lot worse. So now they all feel guilty because they think, you know, if they were just playing properly as a team, that this probably wouldn't have happened. Ugh. Maybe winter, but it sure is still thirsty. <laughs> Or should I say, I am still thirsty. Ugh, I feel sick. This sucks. It even started raining. So yeah. Now, I believe we're at that point in the story. Where Ayamine and Chizuru's stories diverge. They sort of run parallel, but they diverge. You know what I mean? Also, nice rain effects. Doesn't seem like it'll let up anytime soon. Feels like there was no point in changing clothes. I wonder how the sports festival played out. It was probably cancelled, I guess. I mean, if uh, someone goes to hospital, then I guess, you know, it'd be kind of difficult for everyone to continue. And the rain, of course. <laughs> Can't forget that. After all that craziness, I doubt anyone felt like holding a closing ceremony. Yeah, because I think the uh, lacrosse tournament was the uh, final event. Which is normally a team relay, isn't it? That's normally the last event of a sports event. They called an ambulance and everything. Before I entered Hakryo, I heard tales of their athletic festivals being so intense that they always had an ambulance on standby. Wow. <laughs> Seems a lot less funny now that it used to. It certainly does, man. Is class rep still changing? I came all the way to the dressing room. Should I just call her name? Oi! Class rep! Oi! You done changing yet? If you don't answer, I'm gonna peek in there! Man, she must really be zoning out. No reaction. Did she go home already? That really hurts. I wanna cry. <laughs> I'm already sniffling. Well, that's probably because you're in the rain. That's probably why. Class rep, I really am going to open the door. I put my hand on the knob. I'd better not get a nosebleed from whatever I see in there. Come on, Takiru. I know you're trying to loosen her up, but this is not the way to do it, man. Hmm. Well, I've asked several times now. It's probably okay for me to open it, right? I'm coming in. Oh, too late. Oh, it's pitch black in here. At least turn the lights on. Dame. What? <laughs> Not sure I can help myself. This is technically a girl's changing room after all. <sighs> She's clearly not in the mood for this, dude. Then again, it's unclear if this particular one has anything to worth the price of admission. Tsukenaide. Why not? Are you still naked or something? Why would she be in the pitch black? <laughs> it's okay. Don't worry. I have no particular interest in your body. <laughs> oh, no, no, Takeru. Come on, man. He is an idiot. He has no tact in these situations a lot of the time. <gasps> I see your game class rep. You're trying to seduce me into doing... Something or other. How 
How can you say that? You can hear the sobs. We can. I know. A comeback would be nice. Or at least a courtesy laugh. <laughs> hmm? Whoa. Are you crying? Let's see. Where's the light switch? I'm turning them on. Damn it. Ikuzo. Damn it. I'm about to flip it. Ready? Damn it. Jeez, man. Oh my goodness. Oi. Oh my god. Someone's trashed her uniform. I mean, we knew from Ayamine's route the rest of the school were pretty cruel about the whole thing, but... Man. Nani? Kore? Her uniform's been torn up and thrown unceremoniously on the ground. The locker with Sakaki written on it is dented. And I can see a torn up skirt behind its broken door. What the hell happened here? Boy, this school, man. This school. Why did this happen? Must have been the accident earlier. Nothing else it could be. Whoa, now. Wait a second. What the hell? What happened to Suzumiya wasn't your fault, class rep. It was an accident. Shiksha! This is so wrong. Why are they harassing you like this? This is unforgivable. I'll find the bastards that did this. Yamete. <laughs> Freaking hell. Class rep. No, it isn't. No, it is not. Don't think that way. It's not your fault. I was going to say, how do I turn the auto off now? <laughs> oh, there you go. That's all I wanted. But that is still... Absolutely unforgivable. Are it? <sighs> no, it wasn't. <sighs> I mean, we always knew that it was always going to be difficult for Ayamini and Chizuru not to, uh, confront or conflict with each other during the match. It was an accident. Whoops. Class rep certainly wasn't acting rationally at the time. It's true that she's not entirely free of blame for what happened to Suzumiya. That can't be denied. To everyone else, it probably looked like she got overzealous and beating Suzu at, at, about beating Suzumiya and lost her cool. But in reality, her distrust of Ayamini was definitely the bigger problem. In fact, I think she was probably focused on that to the exclusion of anything else. Based on that alone, I guess you could judge Class Rep pretty harshly for her negligence. But that's no reason to treat her like this, is it? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. I can understand why you'd want a scapegoat, but this is beyond excessive. Normally, Class Rep would be saying something pretty similar right about now. For better or worse, she's a strong, self-assured person. That's why it's so easy to tease her. She always gives as good as she gets. Which is what we saw at the museum, didn't we? So how the hell could she be this shaken up about this? Her distrust of Ayamine caused the accident. That's gotta be it. She's beating herself up over that. She feels guilty about her carelessness. Guilty about the way she treated Ayamine. 
and there's something else deep down. Something she probably hasn't even noticed herself yet. Class rep has a strong sense of responsibility. She sees the world in black and white, not shades of grey. And right now, that means she's blaming herself like nobody's business. I'd like to tell her how stupid and pointless that is. But somehow, I don't think it's going to make her feel any better. Eeyore. We'll talk about that later. Let's just go home for now. Come on, at least stand up. Okay? What do you mean? I couldn't do anything either. Damn it, class rep. You need to stop. Stop blaming yourself for it. It's not healthy. <laughs> class rep? What do you want me to say? I won't blame you for anything. If it's a scolding you're after, you're not going to get it from me. Only a real idiot would be able to do that in a situation like this. At least in my opinion. No, I think that's true. I think she's she's hurting enough. Or do you want me to try and comfort you and tell you it's going to be okay? Maybe she does. But that'd be odd to expect considering how much she blames herself. She? Is she talking about Ayamine? Well, Ayamine is very mysterious. She just happened to know what to do. You're not comparing yourself to her after all this, are you? <laughs> Why are you doing that? Stop blaming yourself like that. Come in. If you want me to comfort you, don't worry. I'm going to do it even if you don't say anything. Now stand up already. That's it. That's it. He's, he's behaving like he should now. I mean, how could he not after seeing this scene? I take class rep's arm and help her to stand up. Let's go outside. <laughs> just pick up your bag and walk outside. Oh, and hand me your gloves. She's just staring blankly. As she, she can't even understand what I'm saying. I take her hands and pull her gloves off myself. Here, you can wear this. I take off my uniform jacket and drape it over her shoulders. Oh, I may not have to, but I just want to, okay? <laughs> Come on. I ignore her words, thrust her book back into her hand and push her out the door. It's raining, so looking up at the sky won't make her feel any better. But it's better than staying in here, especially in the dark, on her own. Wallowing in her own misery. After pushing class rep outside, I pick up a uniform from the floor. Man, it's completely shredded. I fold it in half, bringing the sleeves together. Together? Mm, sorry, hiccups. Woo. This might be the first time I've ever held a girl's uniform like this. I don't even remember, remember touching Sumika's. Looking more closely. It seems pretty well worn, although a boy's uniform would be totally worn out by the third year, especially the openings of the sleeves and the seats of the pants. I can't understand why some creepy old pervs covet these things, but more than that, I can't understand why anybody would want to rip one up like this. Still, she just stayed quiet the whole time. What a way to end the day. It doesn't matter if you're a boy or a girl, this is about as painful as it gets. Don't those assholes get it? Well, of course they don't. They're more, they're more content on sh placing blame. Even if they're all tattered and worn out, 
People grow attached to clothes they wear for so long. Vandalizing them is like invalidating all the memories that go along with them. Not that bullies would even consider such a thing. They just get emotional and in an outburst of rage commit some horrible act that can never be undone. Damn it! Even her skirt. Oh man, they really shredded this one. If she wore this in public, she'd be arrested for exposure. I fold up the blouse and skirt and put them in a plastic bag. Not that there's any point in folding them. I just can't bring myself to treat them like trash. I touch a hand to the dented locker. There's no way to repair this. Even if her uniform can be replaced, there's no way they're going to put it in a brand new locker for her. Should I just beat it up even more so that no one would disagree that she needs a new one? Class rep's going to remember this every time she sees it. <sighs> really is horrible. It really is. <laughs> oh yeah, I've left her out in the rain. Ooh, that was probably very uh, inconsiderate of me. Hmm? Oh, go in. I'll be right there. Should I ask Mei to have Tsukiyomi discreetly bring a car for you? E. Then I'll walk you home. E. No, you're not. You're clearly not. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so horrible. Daijobu deska? I take two umbrellas out of the umbrella basket and hand one to her. Use this. It is. It's <laughs> Even now she doesn't trust him that he that he isn't doing something like that. Nope, it's mine. You wouldn't use it unless I said it was, right? You wanna go home wet? Oh. I mean aside from being wet faced from tears, maybe. If you won't let me walk you home, at least use this. I force it into class rep's hand. Her hands are freezing, and I don't think that's because of the air temperature. Her delicate fingertips remind me that underneath all of the scolding and her strong attitude, she's still a fragile girl. Well, none of this is right. Let's be honest. You're allowed to do it every once in a while. And right now is one of those times. Go on, run along home. See you later. I'll go once you round the corner and I can't see you anymore. <laughs> I don't I don't trust you not to be doing something you shouldn't. <laughs> don't mention it. And by the way, do you have a spare uniform? Well, that's a mercy. But then you always need to have at least two or three sets of uniform. One to wash, one to uh, wear, and one just in case. Then come back tomorrow like nothing happened. I'll do the same and act like an idiot so you can blow up at me. <laughs> uh, well, I can understand that. Arigato. <laughs> Hmm? Well, yeah, that uniform has lots of memories, as he said. Well, that's all I really could do. Oh, yeah, there's that too, isn't it? Just wear it. Get going already. No need to thank me. Uh. Take care on your way home. Mm. <sighs> ah, bullies. Just another part of school life. Not that it's right that there should be people like that. Class rep walks out in the rain. She really does look lonely. 
I walk to the front of the school school and see class rep walking down the hill. I've never seen her look so weak. It's so different from her usual self that it's painful for me to have to watch. But I have no intention of nosing around and causing even more trouble. Since I'm sure class rep doesn't want to look for the culprit. As unusual as that may be for her. So once she apologizes to Suzumiya, things should take care of themselves. Mm, but as with Ayamine's route, we know that's not going to be so easy. And even if they don't, we'll graduate in a few months and it won't matter anymore. Well, you, you'll, you don't really want your last memories of your school life to be painful, do you? So then, why do I feel so unsatisfied? Why is this irritating me so badly? <sighs> it is what it is. I suppose they aren't aware, are they? If only you'd seen class rep yesterday, you'd understand why he's feeling so down in the dumps. Well, you've got a point, but... You two didn't see class rep yesterday. That's why you can say that. After what they did to her, there's no way she'd be alright. Damn it, it's enough to make me sick. Those bastards are all a bunch of cowards. They can't even say this shit to her face! <sighs> what should I say to her? Suzumiya-san, how was it? Hmm? Oh, it looks like she's going to be just fine. But since it's a head injury, they want to run a few more tests on her, just to be safe. Doesn't matter to the people who um, attacked class rep and potentially I mean it. Uh, she should be back any day now. Hmm? Hey, isn't that class rep? Class rep! Whoops. What's happened? <laughs> uh, early impressions. She does seem to be taking the advice to heart and just acting like nothing happened. Okay, no, no, forget that. Man, she looks really down today, but. Yokata. Naniga? Oh, Gomen, I'm just glad you actually came in uniform today. <laughs> I guess you did say that, didn't you? Soka, <laughs> well, maybe you did. Demo. I guess I just couldn't help but worry until I saw it for myself. <laughs> you okay now? Mane. Yeah. But your sad face doesn't really make me believe that very much. She's not okay at all. But I can't find the words to console her. And when I think about how she must have felt yesterday, it just hurts. I've never felt this bad before about someone else's problems. Uh, look, there you go. Ohayo. Gomenasai. Don't worry, they're not gonna blame you. <laughs> yeah, even if you did put your uh, enthusiasm in the wrong place. She did, but I don't think it's making her feel any better. <laughs> Thank goodness for that. Well, let's hope so. Ch Mate, 
we have to clean? So uh, <laughs> Whoops. My bad. You. Something's up. What is up? Never mind. Was that just me? It felt like someone was watching me. I don't like the sound of that. Hi, ohayo. Marry chan Kirit. No one's gonna stand, are they? Yeah, I didn't think so. Ara, mina kinikutsu. Mo, wakai na kara shakit to shinasai yo. Well, it's not really it, is it? It's not that. They're all disobeying class rep's orders. What the hell? Even the people who were sucking up to her up until yesterday. <laughs> you don't even need to say it at this point. Although they're all standing up now. <laughs> it wouldn't surprise me. Well, at least we don't have class today. Class rep would probably be feel better moving around a bit than sitting all day. Oh, I don't really think you should be singling out the lacrosse team at a time like this, really. The moment she says lacrosse, the air in the room changes completely. ご告知しておくわね。リーグミの鈴宮さんのことだけど心配はいらないそうよ。頭を打った可能性があるので、一応検査入院という形になってます。でもあくまで念のためですぐ退院できるそうです。I mean, it's good of her to try and soften the blow, but I don't really think it's going to really make much difference at this point. She can sense the atmosphere in the room, so she's being really careful about how she words it. Thank you, Mickey. Marimo-chan, you're handling this in the most teacherly way possible. Well, she is a teacher, Takiru. You may forget that some of the time, but she is a teacher and she is very responsible. I have a bad feeling about this. Everyone keeps shooting each other meaningful glances. I mean... I get that it was our last high school sports festival and that no one would have wanted it to end that way. It sucks that there had to be an injury right when everyone was getting all fired up. But it's not like she hurt her on purpose. It only happened because class rep and Suzumiya were both taking it super seriously. Hard to believe these guys all were all totally dependent on class rep until just now. And this only happened because she was giving her all for the team. They're all treating her like a villain, just because she hurt the star player. Well, she hurt one of the star players. <laughs> she was the other one, of course. What the hell do they want from her? Are they really trying to say that class rep did something wrong? はい、それじゃあ中庭担当の人は私についてきてね。体育館の方はカームラ先生が担当だからそこに行って聞いてね。<sighs> It just keeps replaying in my head. I can't ignore what happened to class rep yesterday. Wow, cleaning the place where the accident happened. That's not great, is it? Ugh, what a pain. And yet, it won't do any good if I make it super obvious that I'm trying hard to be careful and considerate of class rep. To be fair, this time anyway, it isn't what he's it isn't his intention at all. <laughs> hi, hi. Looks like I'm in the same group as class rep. 
Looks like it. Ugh, it's freezing. So long as we don't have to do the leaves as well, otherwise we'd never get it done. <laughs> gotcha. Okay, fair point. Yada! <laughs> oh. Why does the courtyard have to include the whole perimeter of the club building? Who assigned these areas? Whoever it was ought to take a look at the map and rethink it. I mean, it's not like you're the only one who has to clean Takeru. Come on. It'll be a lot quicker with more people. Ugh. Not really the place you want to be near at the moment. Yeah, can you not understand why he might not be enthusiastic about having to work there? That much is true. なるほど。球技大会といえば運動部員の活躍の場。散らかるのも頷ける。you know, theoretically, you guys COULD offer to help deal with it yourselves. Bunch of jerks. <laughs> Whoa. All this garbage got wet from the rain yesterday. I don't want to touch it. I <laughs> mean, no one wants to touch wet litter. Right. The rain. If only it had been sunny yesterday evening. Then maybe class rep would have felt just a little better. Speaking of which, the lacrosse lockers. No, no point thinking about it now. Hmm? I can hear laughter. Did someone sneak off from their cleaning duty? Oh no. Hmm? They're talking about class rep? Of course they are. It's sure to be the talk of the school. What? Hey, good to see one of them isn't stupid. <laughs> Her logic's all messed up, but whatever. Why would anyone think she did that? They're, be they're BFFs for crying out loud. <laughs> Man, this is really infuriating. あ、ゆえりとキドリは自分中心に物が回ってないと我慢できないんでしょ。自分以外全員バカだと思ってるんだろうね。はいはい。あんたは頭いいですねって感じ。Seriously? How can they just run their mouths like that when they don't have a clue? なんかいつも一人で張り切ってたけどさ。She's a class rep, she has to set an example. <sighs> this is the sad thought process of stu some students. <laughs> Damn it, I can't take this anymore. Yeah, 
All Taka is going to do is succeed in making everyone else avoid him, thinking he's crazy. Where are you? Wait till I give you a piece of my mind. Over there? <laughs> they aren't here? <sighs> there were two girls just now. Did you see them? Damn it, how did they do that? Or is he just listening to two different sets of girls, maybe? Soka. Oh god, here we go. Are? Oh, class rep. Did they assign you to this area too? Were you over there just now? <sighs> oh shit. Things couldn't be worse. She's just rushing it off. Class rep. But was she even there? <laughs> oh, she was sabotaging the process. I mean, how can she if she's hearing people slandering her like that? Um, I think she's going to be able to That's not the problem. If it was just about what happened yesterday, class rep still would have done that. Even if it was just to put up a tough front. That's just the way she is. But... She must have heard what those girls were saying. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, hi! What is it? Oh god, what, what now? <laughs> Are it? What is it? Hmm. Well, of course, she's the teacher. Of course, she'd be concerned. Are it? Oh, uh. Should I really tell her the truth about this? I'm not sure. Getting the teachers involved might just make things worse and hurt class rep even more. That's the that's the conundrum, isn't it? Do you risk making things worse by telling the teachers, or do you just hope that it'll eventually blow over? I guess she took the silence as a yes. Well. Oh, of course. There's no way she couldn't have uh, picked up on the uh, the atmosphere and the fact that they disobeyed her. Uh. I guess it's hard for them to believe, given the circumstances. And in cases like this, people tend to believe what they want to believe, or what's most convenient for them. Especially after hearing those girls talking earlier. I know that all too well. It's really easy to be envious of class rep. Especially because she's this year's top student, is good at sports, and doesn't mince words. It's really making me sick. But unless things escalate, we just have to leave it alone for now. We'll keep an eye on the class rep for you. Aww, 
Well, yeah. It's a shame that they can't have... They're not these omnipotent beings who can make everything better just clicking their fingers and hoping everything will just sort itself out. If the teachers start kicking up a fuss, it'll only make things worse. Please don't do anything for now. So, yeah. Suzumiya-san ga tain shite kureba, jokyo mo kawaru de shou kara. Yeah, because they're BFFs. I mean, rivals and friends, so, you know. Hopefully, she can smooth things over and everything will go back to the way it was. I don't think Class Rep will forgive herself right away, but we can't do anything about that. It'd only be harder for her if we messed, if, if this mess she, she's in turns into a huge uproar. I mean, yeah, I guess that's understandable. So yeah, well, we were we were trying to get uh, well, we were comforting Ayamine during her route. Chizuru was going for all this shit, wasn't she? But at least she got over it in the end. So you know, guess this time, Chizuru's the one we're gonna help, and Ayamine will just do her own thing. W what is it? Sakaki san to. あやみねさんに伝えてほしいことがあるの。あらい、オッケー。あれ。鈴宮さんの入院ね。1週間ぐらいなんですって。わお。That's <sighs> Well, if it's the family who's concerned, I guess I can understand. <sighs> well, I think that's reasonable. But man, those sound like some overprotective parents. Oh, is that right? Are? <laughs> That is quite a coincidence, isn't it? <laughs> wow. Come to think of it, she did say something about introducing me to a good neurosurgeon. Back when she sent Sumika flying into the stratosphere. <laughs> that she did, didn't she? <laughs> okay, understandable. Well, Suzumiya says you got her future all laid out for her, right? In that case, I guess it shouldn't be a problem if she's out of school for a week. Oh, come on, Marimo chan You have to do that now. Alright, I understand. Uh, good plan. If word got out that they were called to a meet with a teacher, that'd be the last nail in the coffin for them. Ah, oh, come on, Marimo chan <laughs> Buttering me up won't get you anywhere. Or maybe it will. I know. Not that I have anything against it, but. Why me? なおかつ、一番近い人は白金くんかなって思ってるんだけどな。I guess that's her teacher's instinct at work. Since when? Fair aside. You think I'm the closest? What the hell gave you that idea? それに、B組女子ラクロスチームの監督さんじゃない? I guess that's really all she needed to say. <laughs> uh, uh. Okay, that's okay. You've, you've, you've convinced me. わかりました. <laughs> Leave it to me. あと、できればお見舞いに行くようにもうながしてね。あれ多分、行きづらいと思うのよ。今の状況じゃね。Well, I am mean, I'm sure we'll... She'll work it out. They just need a little push in the right direction, you think? Genki na Suzumiya san wo jika ni miru no ga ichiban ii to omou no. 
入院は一週間だけなんだし。OK。You've got a point。こういうのは早めがいいのよ。行きそびれちゃったらもっと気まずいでしょ Yeah, really. Class rep has to get out of her,、uh, get out of the dumps, so to say, and、uh, do it. Wakarimashita. Jao Negai. So let's just so Jinny Modote. I'm just enjoying not having to clean, though. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Whew. Finally done. Hmm? It suddenly feels really tense in here. Why are they all staring at her? So that's what's going on here. What the hell do you guys think you're doing? You're gonna ostracize one of your classmates like that? I can understand being disappointed that your last sports festival had to end on a sour note. And you were all really excited about the possibility of winning the, that lacrosse match. After all that build up, I can understand why you need to blame it on something. But she's not the one you should be blaming. Do you treat all your classmates like that? <laughs> no matter how you look at it. No, that's the way you want to look at it. Damn it! <laughs> I know. I know it's not my job to fight class reps' battles. But still! We can hear you, you know. At least pretend to whisper quietly. You're being this loud on purpose, aren't you? It's seriously pissing me off. At the end of the day, it's all about them. So, so, Lunch? Why the sudden change of topic? Is it just so they can walk by class rep and give her a bit of a, a push or something, you think? There are still ten minutes left before lunch starts! あ、ちょっと待ちなさい。今のどう? Notice how it's all the female classmates who are doing this. You guys too? So, so, Ayamine san, eh? So, Dio, Ayamine san, you make a set about your cat on Dio, eh? Are this is horrible. No, the Makasino cat on Daro. Chidewa, I don't really could see Derukedo. You're silly. I can understand that line of logic to a point. I can. I actually can, you know. But, you know. ちょっとそれ陰険臭くない? 
Come on, Chizuru. Are you really just gonna let them run their mouths like this? Ah, Man, this is what she was putting up with during Ayamine's route as well, you know. This is just... God damn it. ずぶといんでしょ。今日もちゃんと早く来てるし。普通来れないよね。どういう神経してんだろう。そなたたち、いい加減にしたらどうだ。メア。坂木に言いたいことがあるのなら、本人に面と向かって言うがよい。そ、そうだよ。そういうのダメですよ。Well, <laughs> they're not gonna listen to you girls either, cause you're part of the team, aren't you? そなたらは自分が。三つ剣さん、いいのよ。坂木。You <laughs> shouldn't have to put up with this shit. <笑>好きに言わせておけばいいわ。無理にかばってくれる必要なんかない。ちょっと聞いた無理なんて。とにかく余計なことしないで。勾配でも学食でも行きたければ行けばいいわ。あらら、かばってくれた三剣さんたち
I've got my own way of doing things. Jana! Alright. I agree with what Maya said. But I just can't accept that. I saw what happened in the changing room. I could tell she was just bluffing earlier. Damn it. Learn to share the load every once in a while. If I find you depressed and crying somewhere, I'm going to have some choice words for you. There you are. Class rep. I need to talk to you. That's not it. Just come with me. Well, no one's going to disturb us up here, are they? <laughs> Alright. Let's see. Aha! There you are, Ayamine! Of course she was here. Get over here. Come on. Yeah. Let's go to the hospital. Eh? Let's go visit Suzumiya today. Uh. Come on, you have to. Do, do <laughs> because I can tell you two aren't going to do anything. <laughs> because Marimo-chan asked me to. <laughs> Wait till they hear this. If she told you in person, it'd just start more rumors, right? Sensei's trying to be considerate. Why? I mean, considering the situation. Oi, don't you don't don't you get snippy with me? Oh come on, seriously? You hearing this? I can do this. I can sort everything out by myself. Do you have to be so mean about it? So ne. Chotto kanjo teki ni natta wa. Gomen nasai. All right. All right. Forgiven on this occasion. I don't like that tone of voice either. Oh right, yeah, she was being snarky. Nani yo? Stop trying to sound so damn apathetic. You're just pretending to be cool and in control. Not in the slightest. その口を気に入らないわね。何結局自分の思った通りに事を運ぼうとして隙を伺ってるような口調のことよ。人の話理解してるふりして。I <laughs> just love how hey, Amina is basically like, I ain't getting involved in this shit. <laughs> Alright, yeah. I'll believe it when I see it. Oi! Mate! <laughs> yeah, she is a handful, that one. Are? Mate! <laughs> what the hell do you mean by that? You better. Then let's go. <laughs> Why is everyone saying, I don't need your help, I can do this on my own? <laughs> oh yeah? <laughs> I'm not mad! <laughs> <sighs> You are so easy to read. <laughs> I just don't like seeing my friends getting hurt. But I... <sighs> Alright, no reason for me to get mad. She might be right about that, I guess. But who the hell wouldn't get pissed off at this? Sure, I'm not the victim here. And yeah, there might not be a reason for me to be angry. 
But I'm freaking disgusted. I mean, who wouldn't be? Hmm? What? What? Huh? Worst timing ever. What the hell are you doing, Marimo-chan? And why are you calling her to the counselor's office anyway? I thought you said you were going to leave her alone. I wouldn't call summoning her over the intercom leaving her alone. Ack! Excuse... Class rep? Ah. Uh. What's wrong? What? Oi! What the hell? Don't tell me that was a prank. Sumika, class rep just... What is it? Oh no, what now? What happened? Are? You should be suspended for a week. More like expelled. If anything happens to Suzumiya-san, it's your fault. Suzumiya-san's in a completely different league from you. Drop dead. Don't be so full of yourself. What the hell are these? Nani? Kagami! Ah, Takeru. Takeru san? Man. If this was just a few isolated people bullying her, it's one thing. But if virtually the whole student body's doing it, how much pressure and how much. How much is that for you? Oh my god. <sighs> yeah, I, I, I thought something was wrong. Knew what? This is some messed up shit right here. What did you say? This is some in this is this is next level bullying. This is a this is an epidemic. Oh my god, damn! You went to the broadcasting room, right? Did you find out who asked them to make that announcement? So it is all the uh, seniors who did this. Then let's find that upperclassman! Was it a boy or a girl? Well, if you had noticed, all the uh, all the all the people saying bad stuff about her were girls. So it doesn't surprise me that a girl was behind it. To be honest, that narrows down the list of suspects. Maya, you could find her, right? You could get Sukunomi san to. Nani? What are you getting at? Sonata in a sense, it does seem like you're being a bit selfish about the whole thing. I mean, he doesn't mean to be. <sighs> However... Yeah, he's literally doing what he wants, not really what Sakaki wants. 
私たちが犯人を見つけ出し榊の前に引きずり出して謝らせるなどということを望むだろうか I mean, let's be fair. There's no way they do it willingly. <laughs> they'd no way they'd willingly apologize either. Because, like Mia said, they believe they're just. I know what you're getting at, but still. That doesn't mean we have to watch her suffer from the sidelines. <sighs> If it were me they were calling an idiot, I'd just shake it off. But look at what they're doing to her. Takeru san. Suspension? Or expulsion, even? What did she do? Class rep follows the rules better than anyone. What do they mean she's in another league? Class rep and Suzumiya are close friends. Those are all pretty heavy words for class rep. What the hell would you even know about that, princess? Takeru-chan, it's too much! The good one, Kagami. Takeru said that it's not wrong. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, Crap. I saw a class rep crying, so I just lost control. Gomenasai, Mia. I shouldn't have blown up on you. Right, class rep! It's all we can do at this point. I'll look too. Let's go. Damn you all. Stop screwing with her! What the hell are you trying to say? Up until now, none of you ever complained about class rep. None of you ever had a mind of your own, and you don't even have the nerve to say any of this to her face. Oh, here we go. Nani? That idiot! She, she can't. She's finally snapped, I guess. That 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 scene she witnessed at the student council office must be what all, all this must have triggered her completely. Class rep, come here for a second. Just get over here! <sighs> what the hell am I doing? We just ran away together. This is no laughing matter. Calm down already. This isn't like you. If you keep that up, you're just gonna add fuel to the fire. Unfortunately, that's not how high schoolers generally tend to function. You are like the opposite of cute, you know that? <laughs> no. Okay, look. You clearly do. <laughs> Mate! Nani? Class rep, you. Let them, I don't care. I don't care what they say about me. Stop forcing yourself! Sumika, Maya, and Tama are all worried about you. Any normal person would have run far, far away by now. Quit pushing yourself. Sorry. I got to see your weak side, so I know exactly that you are just putting on a front. I know I'm being nosy, but still. Fine. I don't care anymore. Just do whatever you want! 
何勝手に怒ってるのよ<笑> Yeah, you're right. So sorry. I forgot. I have nothing to do with this. You're just so strong after all, class rep. None of that hurts you in the slightest, does it? <laughs> you can handle everything on your own and control all your emotions, can't you? <laughs> Eat it! He went too far, but she kind of asked for it, didn't she? Why does this irritate me so much? I knew how that'd make class rep feel, and yet... <sighs> I acted like her friend, then drove her into a corner. I really am horrible. Horrible. The more I think about what just happened, the worse I feel. I really screwed up. I'm horrible. Class rep was in so much pain that she let her true feelings slip. Why am I putting extra pressure on her? Damn it! <sighs> Should I have just watched and waited like Maya did? If I had... Maybe I wouldn't have to have had her to hear those words. Probably. I'm so stupid. I made class rep cry. Ugh. Eat it! Go, la. Mo home room o watch at all, yo. Marimo chan. Nani? No way! Ah. Oh, everyone is here. They say every time you sigh, you let a bit of your happiness leak out. Are <sighs> A book bag and a piece of paper? <laughs> they know. Sakaki needs to realize just how mu how good her friends really are. Soka, so she never came back then. Well, of course she'd remember her shoes. Soka, she just ran outside after all. Hmm? What do you mean? We need you to bring Sakaki with you, okay? <laughs> the hospital? Well, I guess that is true. <laughs> No, we are all a part of this, so we all have to apologize together. Hmm. Demo class reps. And you can understand why. Absolutely. Yeah, you know. Everyone can go again. It doesn't mean you're only limited to one visit. Soka. Yep. Just understand, Sakaki, you have some really great friends. Got it. You guys take care of Suzumiya then. Mm. I'm counting on you, Mia. Sonata mo na. Takeru-chan, atashi mo, atashi mo. 
even when it's not a route between those two, Sumika still wants to be included when Maya is. <laughs> Don't cause too much of a racket in the hospital. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Next, left at that corner. Another left there, and then left again. I is that it? Take a left past... Are? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> what kind of sloppy roundabout map is this? Did Marimo-chan really write this? Just know, if you just keep going left, you're just gonna go in a complete circle. <laughs> um, over there. I is this the place? That's a surprisingly nice house. It feels like it's been left behind in all the development surrounding it, but I don't dislike that. Alright, I'm not getting anywhere by complimenting their house. <laughs> That's right, yeah. You gotta knock on the door or ring that doorbell or whatever. Hmm? Oh, is this Chizuru's mother? I mean, she's got the eyebrows and the brown hair, so surely, right? Are it? Oh, are you? Is this woman class rep's mom? Well, ideally, yes. F for some reason, I would have imagined her looking... Well, certainly not like this. She's young and kind of flashy, but her face seems a little plain, somehow. I thought she'd be wearing traditional clothing or pointy-rimmed glasses. Well, okay. Uh, ano... Is Chizuru-san available? Well, that's not a good sign. Oh, Soka. <laughs> no, doesn't look like it. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, hi. Nee, kimi, shirogane kun yo ne. Oh, so she knows about me, huh? <laughs> Are it? Oh, hi. I am actually. Nani shi ni kita no? Oh, uh, I'm here to deliver Chizuru's Chisan's book bag. Kaba? What? Why not? What? Well, uh. Ah, good. Hear it's not easy. So, Shirogane-kun got to the place. Is that the thing? She's a very mysterious lady, isn't she? Are? <laughs> if you want to, I guess. So, yeah, so I'll take you. Okay then. I guess I'll get out of your hair now. ねえ。何学生手帳ってなくても大丈夫なのああ、いいかいでどうだい。あれ。ああ。come <笑> Well, she seems the complete opposite of her daughter, and maybe that annoys her? Maybe there's not a very good home life because they confl conflict with each other, maybe. Maybe this is partially why the stress is built up and she wants to do everything on her own. It could- that makes sense! Uh, it thought, uh, okay. You're welcome. Sayonara. Hmm, I just don't get it. Isn't she bothered by the fact that her daughter's bag came home and she didn't? Why'd she say there was no point in asking? And if she'll get mad if her mum returns my ID, does that mean she knows it's in there but didn't touch it? Well, I only just remembered about the ID, so it doesn't really matter if I have or not. But it does feel strange. I was planning to apologise if she'd been home. Looks like I'll have to do it tomorrow.
All right, guys. Um, I'm going to take a break. And I'll do uh, Atelier Riser in about an hour or two. So assume about half seven. I'll be back to do Atelier Riser. So, yeah, thanks for watching at this point. Look forward to Atelier Riser in just about two hours. So I'll see you then. See you in a bit.